welcome to my youtube channel mechanical magic mechanical learning tutorials so here i am describing the some of the construction and the working of the double housing planner machines so let us see the construction of double housing planner machines so starting with the bed or you can say the base so base that will be made of the casting so that will be having a good rigidity to withstanding all kind of cutting forces and vibrations during the cutting operations so on to the bed there will be the one more important part and that will be called as a table so what happened the table that will be resting onto the bed and that will be having a large so what happened the table it will be resting onto the bed and table that will be reciprocate So the movement of the table that will be the reciprocating. So on to table our workpiece that will be fixed. So workpiece it will be held on to the table and table is being reciprocating. And as you can see the two more things and that will be the cross rail elevating screw. So here it will be the two columns. Column number one column number 2 with the application of the cross rail facilitating or you can say the elevating screw so by the two columns with that facility it will be having the two more side tools so these are the two tools so one and two and that will be reciprocate onto the horizontal directions and that will be the cross rails we already discussed into my previous lectures so basically cross rails is being used to support the tool heads and these tool heads it will be reciprocate so in that double housing planner the two tool heads that will be reciprocate you can say according to the my size and shape of the workpiece it being adjusted so the height of the workpiece it will be adjusting by these two columns and according to my required space or you can say required working surfaces it will be easily used so basically what happens the workpiece it will be mounting onto the tables and that will be reciprocates so these all are stationary members and the position of these fours so that will be one two three and four so you can use four kind of tool mechanism for the single pass operations so what happened just we can see so the double housing planner consists of a long heavy bed so which is supported onto the table and is being reciprocated on the other side of the bed near to the center are located to upright the housings and the housing supported onto the cross rails upon which the one or more or two then two tool posts it will be supported onto the guides so in the modern housing planner machines a tool head is provided onto the each of the housings so the tool are fed across the works so the tools are fed manually or by the power so you can use the individual power mechanism for the operating of that particular all the four tools so the planner table may be driven by either the mechanical movements or you can use the hydraulic device so that will be the all in one construction and the parts of the double housing planner machines and which will be having a maximum industrial applications so if you like this then subscribe and share mechanical magic mechanical learning tutorials thank you very much